God is spirit and God does not live in a temple built with hands, with mortar and clay. He lives in the hearts of those who love Him, of those who are born again, those who are children of God. They are a temple of the Holy Spirit in which God dwells. If Jesus Christ dwells in us, then we will not sin. But demons are also spirits. Satan is also spirit. And many people are filled with demons. Many believers are full of demons. They do not have Jesus Christ in them. If we do not have the Spirit of Christ, then we do not belong to Him. If we have not accepted Jesus Christ and rejected Satan and the demons that controlled our lives, then Jesus will not live in us. Then we are not the temple of the Holy Spirit and we do not belong to Jesus Christ. We first have to clean out the temple, clean out our hearts, repent of sin, reject Satan, reject the evil that was in us, stop sinning, and be baptized in water for the washing off of our sin. Clean out the house and invite Jesus in. Once we have obeyed Him, repented of sin, and cleansed ourselves of unrighteousness, been baptized in water, then we are ready to invite Jesus into our hearts, into this temple, so that He can dwell in us. Then we need to be filled with the Holy Spirit and not allow Satan back in, not give him a foothold, Many Christian believers still belong to Satan. They are in bondage. They cannot stop sinning. They are addicted to sin, pornography, evil thoughts. Wickedness dwells in them. They are filled with evil spirits. If the Spirit of Christ dwells in us, then we will be pure and holy. We will speak the words of Christ. From the fullness of the heart speaks the mouth. If we are not filled with the Holy Spirit, we are filled with evil spirits and they control us. If we have evil spirits dwelling in us, then we do not belong to Jesus Christ. We have to kick them out, invite Jesus Christ in, follow him and obey Him, reserve ourselves for Him, and we will be a temple of the Holy Spirit. If we are not a temple of the Holy Spirit, we will not enter the kingdom of God. Which spirits dwell in us? Are we filled with the Holy Spirit, or are we filled with demons? The choice is ours. Who will you allow to live in your temple. Who is welcome to live in you? Jesus Christ or demons, evil spirits? If we love Jesus and we belong to Him, we will reserve ourselves for Him. We will be pure and holy and will do those things that are pleasing to Him. Are we filled with the Holy Spirit? May Jesus bless you.